It has it's been pure hell, <laughs> to be honest. One room with her three kids inside this transitional house. Ashley Johnson pays $125 a week. But after being off work from two jobs due to the coronavirus, she won't be able to pay. I got a text message this past weekend asked, you know, will money be available? <laughs> you know, and I just have to be honest with her. You know, I, hey, you know, I've told you the week prior when I got laid off, you know, that I won't have it. Johnson is like so many other tenants in Kansas and Missouri making tough choices on this first day of the month. I've got the notification on my phone from the app that they use that $700 is due today. What do we want? Right, the group Casey tenants seen here at a rally before the coronavirus hit is demanding a rent and mortgage freeze from Governor Mike Parson in Missouri to protect tenants statewide. All while they say some landlords are not being flexible. We have been hearing from a lot of tenants in the Casey tenants incident report form that they are either not hearing from their landlord at all or several landlords um, are threatening their tenants. Stress, overwhelm, <laughs> all the, all that. Meanwhile, Johnson has no idea when she'll be able to pay rent next. We spoke with Ashley's landlord off camera today who said she was willing to waive rent and work with her. We'll continue to watch the situation for so many other tenants around the Kansas City area though, who may not have that option. Matt Fleener, KNBC 9 News.